This week, Mexico became the world's first country to approve a vaccine to protect against dengue fever. But questions remain on the drug's effectiveness. CCTV's Martin Markovitz is in Mexico City. Mexican health authorities approved the first vaccine in the world to be used against the dengue virus that sickens nearly 400 million people yearly. Health officials pointed out that this was a victory, especially for the poor, who are more susceptible to the virus, and that it would save about $65 million in health expenditures annually. The effectiveness of this vaccine aims to help the most vulnerable, who cause the biggest strain in our health care system. Developed by the French pharmaceutical group Sanofi, the vaccine named Dengvaxia will be used in areas where the disease is widespread. Dengue is transmitted by mosquitoes, causing flu-like symptoms that can later develop into a deadly infection. It is found in tropical and subtropical climates, but in recent years, cases have spread to the United States and Japan. But questions remain about the vaccine's effectiveness and whether it will be affordable. In clinical trials, it had a 60 percent success rate, much lower than most new drugs in the market. The vaccine is less effective for children under the age of nine, and there are concerns whether the poorer countries will be able to afford the price. Despite limitations, Mexican health officials say the vaccine has a much higher rate of success with older people and is a first step in eradicating this disease. When you give this vaccination to a person between the ages of nine and 43, in 93 percent of the cases, they won't get dengue. That's the strength of this vaccine. Sanofi has yet to agree on a price for its drug, although the Mexican government expects an agreement in the coming weeks as shipments of the vaccine begin early next year. Sanofi has also applied for vaccine approval in 20 countries in Latin America and Asia. They hope to have 2 million doses ready by 2017. Martin Markovitz, CCTV, Mexico City.